Sometimes it's hard to admit to yourself that you're, you're hooked, you're addicted. I lost my family, my friends, my girlfriend. I needed help. I picked up the phone and I called the center and they said, you're not alone. But the first thing, Robert, you've got to admit to yourself, you have a problem. Now I can freely say, I'm a farter. And I like farting. I mean, the, the loud ones, the silent, deadly ones that really stink. Farters Anonymous helped me, and they've helped a lot of people. In the beginning, nobody suspected me. I was addicted. I used to go to office buildings three, four times a week. It got so I'd have to hide from the security officers. I duck around corners. After a while, they all called me stinky. I used to go in the elevators and punch all the buttons and jump off real quick and laugh how the people might be dying. I lost my wife, lost my home. But the center helped me. I don't have those cravings anymore. I was one of the biggest guys at the gym, and uh, I would fart real loud. Big uh, cannonball kind of farts. Like boom, boom, boom. And I remember the other guys used to say to me, they'd say, say hey, why don't you cut that out, you know? But I would do it anyway because uh, I knew I could take them. Anyway, then I uh, lost my girlfriend. One day we went out to uh, our favorite Mexican restaurant and uh, I remember I said something I'll never forget. I said those fatal words. I said, I said, hey, Pancho, double up on the beans. You did. Anyway, we went back to my place and we were uh, watching TV and laying in bed and uh, all of a sudden, I let one go. But this wasn't a cannonball. This one was like a kind of a atomic, kind of a, 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 a nuclear kind of a blast. And uh, it blew her out of the bed into the wall. She's just laying there. And I said, I said, I said, honey, honey. She just had this kind of dazed look on her face. She went into a coma for about three weeks. At Fathers Anonymous, we have doctors that really care. You know, since you're being shot now, what you stinking hands? God damn. Ooh, I told you to hold that part, man. Look, why you let that thing go? Okay, yeah, poor doc. Our doctors work hard. They care about the patients. They're trained to sniff out any problem. It's not just another job. It's an adventure. My name is Nancy, and I'm a farter. My name is Robert, and I'm a farter. My name is Barry, and I, I'm a farter. My name is Lisa, and I pass gas. My name is Anne-Marie, and I poot. My name is Bobby, and I just ate a big old can of beans. <gasps> Barter's Anonymous has helped some people, but not all. Dial 1-800-555-POOP. <laughs>